Good morning guys. Thought I'd make a little video here of my little my basement. Got the uh, I want to show you the rollers that I've been using. These are Kreitlers. Wonderful rollers. And I'm going to make this video with me riding the rollers and talking. Hopefully I can do two things at once. It's Monday morning and uh, it's, pretty, it's pretty nice out there. It's probably about 40 degrees. I'm going to show you a little bit more about my basement. How I got it set up. I got the music the music box here. Right above that is the legendary DeRosa. I hope to fix one of these days. Sure it'd be nice to get it on the road one just even if it's just for riding on Sundays. The albums made it all from Colorado. There's still about six boxes that I need to unpack of albums. And the preferred bike for riding on the rollers has been these this moots here. I haven't fallen off yet, but in the event I do fall off, I think it'll be nice to know that the moots will be will be okay. Anyway, let me get this on the tripod and um, get on the rollers. Well, I'm back. Got my shoes on. Got my little helper here, Buttercup came down to help. She's been good about staying out of the wheels. Anyway, I'm going to put her down, get on the bike, and uh, get this thing going. Say goodbye, Buttercup. Say bye. Yeah. Alrighty. So once again, greetings guys. I imagine the greetings greetings to Ed and Rick, Colorado, Bob and Terry and Arizona. I'm sure you guys, Bob and Terry, are probably laughing, smirking about not having to do this, but yeah, this is this is how I've survived the winter. And riding it's early December. Two to three, four times a week, and doing about 35 minutes, 35, maybe 40. Uh, get the music going real loud. That's been helpful. At least it's kept the weight off this winter.
My last ride on the road's been January 4th. Ever since then, I haven't been outside on the bike at all. Here in the next few days, hope to get out. Supposed to be 50 on Wednesday. So maybe if everything is quiet here, I'll be able to get out. I would also like to send greetings to my cousins in Denmark, Anita, Michael, Hans Kurt. Hey, when are you going to come to Penn Yen and ride the hills of Denmark right here in America? But yeah, it's interesting about these rollers. I've had them now for over 20 years. They're Kreitlers, made in Grand Junction. And early in December, I thought I'd get a replacement belt for it. Turns out they still make them. They still make these rollers in Grand Junction, made by the same family. I think the old man passed away, but family's still running the business. What's nice about these rollers are they're smooth. Really smooth. Hardly any vibration. Quality stuff. So yeah, just wanted to say I miss you guys. Saw the ending of Milan San Remo on Saturday. What a finish. <laughs> I thought Sagan had it in the bucket. But Julian Alaphilip from Quick Step. Oh my God. He is strong. So, hoping, I don't know when, but I hope I'll be able to ride with you guys this year. Don't know how that's going to happen, but still a hope. And maybe the other hope is I make it down to Sierra Vista next winter. Sure could use some of that cactus and sunshine. So guys, just want to let you know I'm thinking about you. I'm doing okay here. In the Northeast, and hopefully, we'll catch you soon, okay? Whoops, adios.